hello guys welcome back to my channel and it's still on this discussion of the lecturers who have been harassing female students for sex it's really really unfortunate that these girls didn't have anyone to speak to about this matter and Kiki the undercover reporter felt that she had to drop out of university because of this that is really so sad it really breaks my heart to hear that you know and um yeah, this is somebody who had been looking forward to going to study in university. I never felt so... Never ever imagined that I would be a victim. I, unprovoked. I didn't do anything. Yeah. Yeah. I'm pretty sure my dad was there. I never got a degree. I never graduated. The harassment forced me to drop out of university. I had nobody to turn to. No future. No money. It almost destroyed me. There are predators everywhere in the universities. And it kills me that there are thousands of other girls that are going through exactly, you know, different variations of what I went through. And it's really sad, really sad that this is happening, you know, and um, nobody seems to do, be doing anything about it. There's no one to talk to, you know, and um, it's, it's something that we need to look into because we can't allow this to happen. As I keep saying, what if it was our sister or our daughter or even our mother, you know, how would we feel? So guys, um, let us not just turn a blind eye to this. Let us do everything we can do to make sure that this ends. You know, many of these rich politicians send their children abroad for university education. So they don't have to go through with this. Maybe if their own children had been subjected to things like this, maybe something would have been done all these years, who knows? But yeah, it's just not right. So I'm just really so sad about the fact that people are dropping out. And it's not like abroad where you have people you can speak to. You have social workers, you have carers, you have people who you can speak to, psychologists and things like that. But now these ladies, are many of them probably dropped out of university. They will be psychologically disturbed you know, and no one to speak to about it, you know, it's, it's really sad, it's sad, really sad.